Yeah, blessing sports trackers. Welcome back to the channel. Now, if you are here for the very first time, I'm going to ask that you please do me a favor and go ahead and subscribe. And after you have subscribed, please hit that notification bell so that you will be notified each time I put out a new video. Please remember to like the videos as well, guys, so that as many persons as possible will be able to see this video. All right, sports trackers. So we bring you some news on Akeem Blake. Akeem Blake will face off once again with Christian Coleman tomorrow, February 11th, at the 115th edition of the Milrose Games over there in New York. Right, so Akeem Blake went up against Christian Coleman last year in this particular race that you are seeing on screen, over 100 meters, and he ran a, a then personal best time of 9.95 seconds to finish second behind Christian Coleman. Now, this young man is an athlete that I'm paying attention to sports trackers because I think he's a very special talent and I think that he will be one of the flag bearers for Jamaican sprinting, for male sprinting in Jamaica, himself an oblique civil this particular year and the years to come. You know, a lot of persons have been critical of male sprinting in Jamaica, especially since the retirement of persons like Usain Bolt, Asafa Powell, Michael Freita and Nesta Carter. You know, we have been searching for that next star. And personally, I think that Akeem Blake and Oblique Seville, we can look to them to really stand up and raise the flag for Jamaica. Now, Johan Blake is still there, of course, but no disrespect to Johan Blake. But in recent times, I believe that these two young men, Akeem Blake and Oblique Seville, they have been showing better progress than um, Johan Blake. You know, track and field is a very ungrateful sports in a sports trackers because we must never ever forget what this young man, Johan Blake, has done for Jamaican sprinting. This young man is a world champion and we must never ever forget that, right? But personally, in recent times, as I said before, persons like Akeem Blake and Oblique Civil, they have been doing exceptionally well. And we want to salute them for what they have been doing. Right, so Akeem Blake is a young man that basically flew under the radar during his years at high school. He went to Merlin Atty High. He was a very, very good athlete while he was at Merlin Atty High. But he was not really one of those athletes that dominated champs. Right? But he's now under the guidance of Michael Freita and his team. And he burst on the scene last year and, has, and he has been doing exceptionally well since then. So we really want to track the progress of Akeem Blake, right? So we will keep you updated on his performance tomorrow at the Melrose Games and all of his performances no. throughout the rest of the season. So that is it for now, sports trackers. Blessings as usual.